Hello everyone, in today's video we shall learn how to do this beautiful gradient title. So let's get started. So I'm going to write down the code and explain it as I go so that you guys can understand. So I'm going to start off with uh, a text. Over here you can write, type in any uh, kind of font that you're looking for. It can either be math SCR or math uh, BB. Uh, any font that you prefer but I'm going to keep it simple and stick to a set of font so after you have locked in your kind of font that you're looking for you can go ahead and focus on color so to do that you have to open a bracket then slash color since you're focusing on color you have to use the function called color right so again after the function color you have to put in an open bracket inside which uh, there has to be a color. So I'm going to use a color code right now and the color code is 8683CE. You have to close it otherwise the color won't work right. So you're going to go ahead and give it a space. So now we have sorted out how we want our font to be and the color to be as well so now we can focus on the other things as uh, like uh, how you want um, how big you want the word to be so we are going to do that right now so to do that you have to just hit space that is backslash in uh, the block equation or the inline equation after that you have to go ahead and hit slash and large this indicates how big your word to be because this is pretty large right so the next portion of the equation is really simple and we want to give it a dramatic flair to it and we would like to give it uh, a slant an italic feel to it so I'm going to be using slash text IT so it will give the slant effect like an italic effect so this is the main part of the equation so you can go ahead and open a bracket and this is where your word would come in so I'm going to use a different one now and hey and as soon as we open a bracket which we did over here you have to close the bracket so now we can uh, go ahead and trace back uh, backwards to see if we have closed all the brackets and to do that you can go ahead and start pairing it like this that's paired and this is paired as well so the only one that is left is this go ahead and close it right there so basically uh, the equation is done but in case you want to add two three lines of different colors like the ones that you're seeing on the screen uh, you can go ahead and type in double slash which basically means you have to um, it's like a stack but it's the next line you know so I'm going to copy this to save time and let's see how it looks on a word so I'm going to use a random word and hey uh, and highlight create function and copy it right there so as you can see it actually works so I'm going to just increase the size a bit let's do h3 all right so let's see how we can actually do 3-4 lines using the same uh, equation. So to do that, now again go ahead and copy this and just paste it right there. Alright, so now we can go ahead and change this color. I think I'm going to go for uh, corn flower blue and hit done. So as you can see that there's two hairs but in different lines uh, and it's looking really cool you know and you can go ahead and change this as well so let's do um, let's do all caps actually how are you or how are you doing like friend style doing right hey how are you doing <laughs> so yeah this is how you can uh, do multiple uh, lines so let's do another one 
I have the same one copied so I'm going to just paste it right there so now we can go ahead and change this I'm going to use our shit and see hit done and there we go it's it's changed so now you can basically change this as well and let's say let's do just do dot 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 it's pretty cool so you can basically type how many ever lines you want and you can just go ahead and change this and you can change the you can change the color and you can change the text uh, so yeah so that's how you get a gradient title and I hope you learned something from this video and I'll see you in the next one bye